what is it? It's usually like a mile to get to school, but it's 25 degrees this morning, so it's very fun with us. Um, but yeah, if you're new to my channel, welcome back. Good morning. My name. Welcome back to another day in my life. If you're new here, my name is Catherine. I'm currently a first year. No, I'm not. I'm currently a second year PhD student studying history at The Ohio State University and today is the last day before Thanksgiving break. I am so excited. I'm flying out super early tomorrow. My flight leaves at 7 a.m. from Columbus to go back to Houston for a few days. I'm very pumped about that. But today I have three classes to get through. I have the class in the morning that I TA for, then I have my independent study right after, literally 15 minutes after, so I gotta rush back over here to Dulles for that. And then this afternoon at four, I have my French class. So a busy day, and then I need to clean my apartment and pack. So we got a lot going on today, but it's gonna be a good day because I'm super excited to go home tomorrow. Office very briefly to get the books that I need for my independent study. It smells very weird in here. Very, very weird and I don't like it. So after my independent study, I might not stay in here to work or I'll just leave the door open, but it smells very weird and I don't know why. Class went well. Um, we only have two classes left and then a review session. So that's pretty crazy. The semester is coming to a close. So I am gonna get out of here and go downstairs for my independent study. All right, the school day is over. Didn't end up getting to film that much on campus today because there were a few people in the office and to be honest, I just felt awkward filming in there while people were working. Um, but I had my class in the morning, then my independent study, which went really well. And then I spent the next few hours working on grading, different essays, different quizzes. I'm so exhausted. I'm so done with grading essays. Graded about 45. I think I have like 23 to go. I'm definitely gonna finish them by next Tuesday. I'm gonna knock some more out tomorrow at some point and then maybe on Friday, I am gonna try and give myself Thanksgiving off. I want a tiny a tiny break, just a, just a tiny little break. Um, but I started not feeling well in my French class this afternoon. So I think I'm just gonna go upstairs and lay on my stomach for a little bit, try and relax and then maybe eat something very light for dinner, something kind of bland, I don't know, pasta, rice, something like that. And then I need to pack. I'm going to be gone for like five days, so not that long, but I'm bringing home a few Christmas presents that I've already bought, and I'm going to be a bridesmaid in a wedding for my friend in January, and I got my bridesmaid's dress, so I need to bring that down with me. So it's already in Texas. It needs a little bit of alterations, so I just want to have all that done in Texas and not worry about me bringing down my dress when I come um, for Christmas. So anyways, that's my plan for the rest of the evening. The first up is rest. The way I am about to be massively overpacking for a literally five day trip is insane. I am taking this suitcase, which is literally what I moved to France with for six months. And this is also what I'm taking home. Um, I probably could take, I probably could take a smaller suitcase, but like I said, I've got my bridesmaids dress, which I actually need to put in the garment bag. It is a really pretty, pretty dress. It is a dark, dark forest green. It's got long straps that go in the back, but it needs to be taken in a little. So I'm gonna put this up and then start putting a bunch of different outfits. I'm trying to think through my packing. I have Thursday outfits for Thanksgiving. I gotta take outfits to walk the dog. So like walking clothes as well as cute clothes going on a little double date on Friday with my cousin and then Saturday hang out Sunday of church Monday flying back that's not that many clothes I am but I need to take this big of a bag because I'm also bringing home a bag of Christmas presents so you know what we're going with this don't judge me actually judge me but I'm still gonna do it <laughs> mm -hmm. 